Hey there folks, Andre the Game Idea Guy here and uh, thank you for lending your ear for another Pitch for Switch discussion. This one's going to also be brief because I don't need to have a long-winded discussion to talk about this. And that's for Sega to redo Sonic Shuffle. It's... Okay, look, I am a longtime Sega fan, a longtime Sonic fan. And this is one of the concepts where they borrowed from Nintendo, obviously, because Mario Party was around well before Sonic Shuffle, but it's not like there weren't other party board games around before Mario Party. Still, Sonic Shuffle was an interesting concept, and it could have gone pretty far if they would have continued it. Now, I remember hearing someone before saying that Sonic Shuffle branched off into the storybook games, but they still have a distinctly different feel from Sonic Shuffle, where Sonic Shuffle is just basically, as, as stated, a party game. You're trying to have fun with it, but it has some, some broader story elements mixed in. At least as far as I remember, I haven't played it in years. But, if Sega could revive it, it could be another contender out there for that type of gameplay. Uh, where people have their characters, you, you pick your favorite Sonic the Hedgehog character and you're in a board game against each other, make, make the story that Eggman is forcing them into these different board game scenarios using technology to create the boards and you have to try to get through it to uh, to stop him. I mean, it's not like that That wasn't a similar concept with Sonic Spinball, which honestly should probably also get put back out, but we're focusing on Sonic Shuffle. I would like to see them, one, re-release the first game, and two, continue after that. Like, it shouldn't be ex excruciatingly hard to come up with a concept for this. And then to add in the other characters, add in Shadow, Rouge, Omega, Cream, any number of characters. Like, you can even add in characters from the comics or even from the anime that never were in actual games as well. For all of the Sonic material that's out there, the board game concept works really well too. Because then you can pull characters again from different universes and throw them in there. You can have different varying versions of all these characters that <clears throat> meet up with each other. And it could be interesting. It, it could be cool. Like you could still have the board game format, make it a fun experience, but then you could always have the extra story implications added in to make a series out of it. Like Sega, you're sitting on something that could potentially be a gold mine and you're not doing anything with it. <laughs> it's like, do something with it. You have it, do something with it, use it for something. And I know that they're trying to revive a lot of their stuff. This would be the perfect time to slide this in there too. Like one thing they could do with all the older games that they're trying to revive is put out the older versions of the games so people can get familiar with them before they release the new games that are supposed to move the series forward. And yes, I know that Sega has done several different collections but sometimes you need a focus, like you need a focal point on certain things. And that hasn't happened for several games. And it would be a good idea to do that. And I think Sonic Shuffle is one of those games that kind of deserves that type of treatment. Again, we already got Mario Party and Sonic Shuffle was the variant for Sega. Just go ahead and do more. So like, they don't have to necessarily have the most expensive thing. They just need to make more and put more out. But I mean, I don't want to drag the conversation on too much. Um, just think it would be a good idea and it could lead to more Sonic Shuffle games down the line. That's it. Otherwise, thank you guys very much for listening in. Keep your eyes and ears out for more stuff from me. And until the next time, enjoy your games. Mm -hmm. Peace out, everybody.
This is Andre the Game Idea Guy, and I'd like to thank you once again for tuning in. Um, if you would be interested in supporting my efforts in content creation, please head on over to Amazon and look up The Game Idea Guy Presents Gaming Word Search, and you will find both Volume 1 and Volume 2 up for sale. Thank you very much once again, and I hope to be able to create more content for you in the future. Peace out.